Yoast, Rank Math, forget them. You don't need bloated SEO plugins. Let me show you something faster, better, and that simple. Slim SEO. Most SEO plugins overload you with settings. Slim SEO, no bloat, no headaches, just results. Enough talking, let's install this and see how it works in real time. Installing Slim SEO is very easy. The plugin is free and hosted on wordpress.org, so you can install it right from within your dashboard as follows. Click to add a new plugin, search in this box by Slim SEO, click install button to install the plugin, and once it's done you click activate. Most SEO plugins have more than 100 settings that make you feel like you are defusing a bomb, but Slim SEO, it just does the work for you. So what exactly does Slim SEO do? Everything Yosa and RankMath do except annoying setup. All right, let me prove it. All of this happens in the background. You don't have to touch a thing. Autopilot mode activated. That's it. No wizard, no 20-step checklist, no confusing settings. Just pure SEO automation. These control what appears in your sites. And so to fix this, you would go to the settings and reading. The syndication fits. Set how many blog posts to include. And for the post content display, you can choose between a full text, which means entire post or excerpt, which is a short preview with a link to the full post. And if no excerpt is set, the first 55 words are shown. And this is determined by the theme you are using. Save changes and that's it. You access the Slim settings by going to the settings tab and from this screen you have the ability to toggle the features you want to use on your WordPress site. Slim SEO simplifies the meta title management by automatic handling title tags for your WordPress site. We don't need to configure any meta title tag because WordPress already has this feature built in. All we need to do is to add a theme support for title tag. I'm using the Bloxy theme, so I, um, I know Bloxy supports this title tag. And for custom post types and taxonomies, you can specify meta title formats by navigating to settings, to meta tags, to manually adjust the meta title for a specific post or term. And from this screen, we will see a list of the available post types and taxonomies available in your WordPress site, and we can configure the meta tags for for them. For instance, I have here WooCommerce products and I can set it here a meta title for a single product and for the product archive. The plugin provides dynamic variables to help you configure the meta tags easier. I will explain more on this feature later, so stay tuned. What is a title tag? To check the true HTML behind the visible internet, simply go to any website with your browser. Let's go with Apple. Right click on your mouse and select View Page Source. This is HTML code you are viewing, it is the true language one of the true languages of the web and this code is what Google or Bing actually uses to index a web page. The very important title tag is this one title, Apple Store Online, Apple Title Tag, closed. And this corresponds to this web link. So the title tag controls the top of the browser. The text you see if you bookmark this page and the headline of the page on Google. So we can say title tags not only speak to the browser, but also speak to Google. Title tags define a web page title and are key for SEO. They appear in the browser, press Ctrl D, they appear in the browser tab and search results. And so in other words, you will insert here keywords into these proper tags. 
and these will then output to Google via HTML. For custom post types and taxonomies, you can set specific meta titles formats by navigating to settings, slim, SEO, and meta tags, exactly where I am now. And here you can utilize dynamic variables to tailor meta titles to your content. Meta title are indexed by search engines and they are displayed in search results. So it's crucial to optimize it to include the keyword you want to rank for. Let's say I have already made my keyword research and my primary keyword is charity. So I will include here charity also my primary keyword phrase as follows the character count limit is 58 and as for the meta description the recommended character count is 99 and if you overpass it put it above 99 the plugin will warn you about the excessive characters what are dynamic variables? Essentially, a dynamic variable is a tag whose value can be changed based on the content or data of the article, website, or in real time. The format is with these curly brackets and has a practical, simple example. I created this SCF radio field asking the reader if they want to become a volunteer. My location is set to my posts. As you can check, so the rule is the post type is equal to post. And this means I'm able to reply this question in the WordPress editor. So let's open the posts and there it is, my ACF ready field. So coming back to Slim SEO and I want to insert in my category a dynamic variable. All you have to do is to click on these three dots and you will find it here at the bottom, my ACF detail. Do you want to become a volunteer? And say so this means the meta description will be automatically replaced by the value of the custom field value. And you can use this feature on posts, page, categories, and tags. As long as you have these three dots, you can pull in the post title, post type labels, the term, the author, the site title or the site description. And this will save you a lot of time and effort to insert the custom values for the title and or meta description. And if you need to manually adjust the meta title for a specific post or term, simply enter your desired title in the search engine optimization meta box and you can have a preview of the post and how it looks like. Another simple example of using dynamic variables is this one. I have a post called how to help local communities and because my main keyword is charity, the SEO optimization is how to help local community and then it follows the site title. And my site title is Hope Foundation, right? And now I want to have the location, the office location. And you can do this by using dynamic variables. Just open these three dots, scroll down until you find the ACF field associated with location. And all of a sudden you will see the preview is New York. Image Alt text is a must-have in terms of SEO and accessibility. In fact, it tells search engines what the images are about. And if for some reason you forgot to enter the alt text, then Slim SEO plugin will, will fix it automatically. How? Let's do this. So I'm going to toggle off the image alt text of Slim SEO. Next, open the media file. As you can see, I have no alternative text, title, caption, description. Now I go back to the Slim SEO. I toggle on, I save the changes. Now go back to the media library and let's check. Don't forget to refresh first. Let's open, opening a media file. And there you have it. My image has alternative text, a title, Slim SEO works. 
Well, it checks if an image is missing the alt text, and if so, it will use the WordPress attachment title, which is this URL, as the alt text. By streamlining this process, Slim SEO eliminates the need for complex configurations, making SEO management much more accessible and efficient. Share your thoughts, check the next video, subscribe to get more videos like this.